Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome back to my channel. If you are a first time viewer, uh, please consider joining the squad and subscribing. We will be putting out a lot of content this year. So make sure you also turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any video. However, uh, for today's video, last year around Black Friday, I made multiple purchases from brands that I consider uh, small operated. And a few of the brand owners actually own a YouTube channel, which I was also subscribed to, and which ultimately led to me creating this YouTube channel. So I'm looking forward to reviewing the packages and some of the content of the items that I received. So let's get started. Okay, so the first package comes in from Triple F Postal. Um, I have a total of three packages today from different brands. And just really quick about this brand, they're actually known for making some very nice cargos, flared cargos, but the piece that actually uh, lured me in or hooked me in was their crew neck, which is cropped and it has a very nice cut to it. So this is the first item we're gonna open up together and we're gonna take a look at it. Okay, so here we have the French Terry point blank crew neck round hem. I'm just starting off with the material. This is a 480 gram per meter French Terry cotton. So right away, I can tell you that it's pretty durable as far as how the material feels. It also has an organic bio wash, which increases the material's lifetime as well as give it luster shine. It just overall softness and one of my favorite details is it was also treated with enzyme which gives it a vintage look or worn in look to it as well overall i just have a lot of respect just for the overall process of this garment to top it off you can see down here at the at the bottom um, you can see that it does have a cropped body which is the cut that really it really sold me just based off the cut. The only thing that I am possibly concerned about was during the purchase process, I was stuck between choosing a large or a medium. After five minutes, the medium sold out in like about five minutes. So I had to go with the large. So I'm hoping that this fits me, but overall I'm pretty happy with this piece. Make sure you stick around to the end. I will have all the on body looks uh, for all the pieces that we reviewed today. Next item. Okay, the next package is from Somar, um, which is owned by, owned by Owen Hyatt, who is also a YouTuber. And actually it was Brandon that um, introduced me to his channel. And ever since then, I've had a lot of respect, you know, uh, at least for his taste in articles of clothing. So for the first piece, I just want to show the package some love. It reads Somar Shipping Services. And right below it, uh, something afar comes this way, which I believe is tied into, you know, the meaning of Somar. And it also has another Somar branding on the package itself. So let's get this one um, open. I have two pieces in here, so let's open her up. Okay, so let's start off with the staff t-shirt, which I received in a large. Also, we got some cool stickers. That's what's up. Yeah, so this is the staff t-shirt. Again, this is in a large. It has a single stitch design at the hem and at the sleeves and at the bottom. And the shirt was actually over dyed in a grayish color or a grayish dye. So after I wear it more and begin to wash it a few more times, the gray will actually start to fade out. If we turn it on the back, we have the design on here. So first, just to point out what it reads, we have the Somar branding, something afar comes this way, and it reads research and development staff. And I also just wanna point out the single line stitch going up the spine of the shirt. So this is pretty much something you can expect me to wear quite often. Um, if you know me, you know I have a very large collection of gray shirts, oddly. Um, but yeah, but I'm pretty happy with this purchase and this is gonna be a good fit, so well done, Owen. 
Okay, the next item is the Somar Geiger trousers. Um, I've been looking forward to these. I decided to grab these in a size 30. I could have went with the 28, but I went with the 30, so hopefully they do fit well in the waist. Another concern with these would probably be the length. In the measurements, it states that it's a length 33 inches, but depending on how high these are gonna fit, um, we'll decide if I need to get it tailored or not. I don't want to alter the original design too much, but let's just walk through the details. So here we have the our silver button. It also comes with the YKK zippers. Those feel good. I can say the over the overall quality of the pants, like this material, is very nice. It's actually really durable. Probably a bit thicker than you know, a pair of Dickies that you may own. Like a, it's pretty much like a luxury version of Dickies. It also has the enlarged belt loops. You'll be able to, you know, put whatever size belt uh, your heart desires. On the back of the trousers, which I also like, you get two pockets uh, with flaps. The right pocket actually has a leather patch with Somar debossed in it. I believe he stated he had some extra leather from a previous project. So I thought that was pretty cool that he decided to make that an addition to the complete design of this pants. Also, another fine detail is going towards the bottom is the split hem design. So whichever shoe you decide to wear this on, uh, once it sit on that sneaker or boot, it gives it kind of a boot cut that kind of falls on the boot. Fatality. Round two, fight. Once you wear this with any sneaker, footwear, or a boot, it lays on the, the shoe or sneaker pretty effortlessly, and it gives it kind of a boot cut fit um, when you wear them. So, well done, Owen. I'm pretty happy with these. These look really nice, and the material um, is, I'd probably rate that as excellent. So pretty satisfied. Again, as with all the other pieces, stick around to the end for the on-body look. Next, the last package and the package I was waiting to get here from the good folks at Vujade, straight from Japan, another fellow YouTuber, Ken Ijima, who also inspired me, you know, just to press record. He filmed a lot of content just regarding fashion, going to vintage shops and just showing his overall manufacturing process. So highly recommend his channel. It's pretty entertaining overall. But um, again, this was the last package that I was waiting for. He did send out some communications as far as that the packages would not go out till around December 18th, at least for the piece that um, I purchased. So for communications, I will definitely, you know, rate them excellent. As far as logistics, I got this around December 27th. But anyway, so we're gonna open this up and we'll go through the details. You can see as far as the box, this is a postal Jap Japan box. So you can see we got the Tokyo Tower on here, some other buildings that I'm not sure what those are. Okay, so here we have the Bujade canvas garment bag. So the only way you would receive this is if you purchase the Allegro work jacket or the Varsity um, that he released. Um. Okay, so here we have the Bujade Alpaca wool Allegro work jacket. Okay, so um, I do have a confession. Um, um, as I've been opening each of these packages, um, I've been trying them on as well. And I just gotta say, you know, all this sh fire. Everything is fire. I Everything is really fitting very good. So please stick around for the for the on body look, seriously. But um, let's get into the jacket. Okay, so again, we have the Vujai Day Allegro work jacket. This is 100% alpaca wool. The quality is very nice. If you could feel it, you might mistake it for cashmere. Looking towards the top, we get the Riri zippers. Um, if you know Riri zippers, then you know that these are very 
top tier high quality zippers making it easy for fastening if we go into the inside of the jacket the lining this is 100 percent rayon which maximizes warmth for this garment looking to the right on the bujai day tag you can see that this was made in japan um, so i could assume that this quality is next to top tier going to the left side interior of the jacket we get this interior pocket which can make it easier for putting your wallet phone keys etc jumping into my favorite part of the design we get the storm flap on the back of the jacket which makes this you know this design so unique is the storm flap actually runs all the way down both sides of the sleeves and another nice detail is they made it so the storm flap can actually be adjustable with the two Cobrax snaps, which you can change the sizing and fitting at the sleeve. So overall, I'm pretty satisfied with this garment piece. I think Ken and the Bujai Day team did a good job. So I'm looking forward to you guys to stick around for the on-body looks. Okay, as always, thank you for sticking around. Let's play the on-body looks now. I don't know if I'm okay. I don't see the light of day. Looking up to high your crown, thinking that'll be your sweet escape. These days gotta schedule the romance. They say that love is a slow dance. A short bike ride to the crib, using no hands. Oh, did it feel like I'm floating? But I'm falling with both eyes closed when I let the world spin. Testing the water, she got my nurse tense. Back when I ain't even have a purpose. I was so eager to learn some things. Anxiety bring out the worst to me. Society paint me as enemy. My n***a's making it by off that remedy. I'm more occasional, don't do it regularly. Backs under my eyes, weighing down heavily. Mama been worried, the devil allegedly deep in the plan. Subconsciously wanted it since I was 10. I thought I was sharp on my scroll and my pen thinking dead. So mama found she did them ledge. She told me that's not who I am. But nowadays I put on for the fam. See you when I can. I'm surrounded by my feelings. I'm stuck on a Ferris wheel. I bet I perish with 140 acres. She wants the horse and the carriage. A portion and portion of garbage. I talk to the mirror. I know that life's not the fairest. I lost my can. I can't pay off the bills with the blessing. I sure I relate to the Reddit page. It's feeling like money is everything. Money is everything. It's everything I need. Till I lay my eyes on you. I don't know what this is, yeah, but it feel like it's real, baby. I don't wanna pretend, no. I just wanna come clear, wanna see you again. This was everything I need, right? Not so fond of change. I'm too caught up in my way of thinking. I get by on me. No, I don't need nobody. Yes, I was so naive. Somehow I'm still all in on me. Yeah, yeah. Way too many times I let the ball drop. Now I'm Steph Curry with the wrist flicks. So they call shows never defrost. Fine, let's go. See you, Lexi. See you, Galib. So we see you at the game? We'll count on you, Cass.